25-year-old Kristen Lenhardt is a Stony Brook University student who hopes to graduate this May. However, the road to getting there hasn't been easy. I have uh, cerebral palsy um, and it's basically brain damage <laughs> um, because I was born two months early um, so my brain didn't quite finish developing. Kristen struggles every day with many of the things that other people take for granted. Getting food from the cafeteria, opening a simple door, or fitting into tight spaces. This is why disability support services is a crucial tool in Kristen's life. I'm so, so thankful for um, the disability support services. Like, when I first came here, I barely use them like I use them to be able to take my exams and things like that but like especially this semester I've had some medical problems and they have been amazing. Kristen is part of several clubs on campus but STAC or students taking aim at challenges is closest to her heart. We exist to um, try to teach people about disabilities and disability awareness, um, especially try to focus on teaching students about, you know, those invisible disabilities, those disabilities that you don't necessarily see, but people have. She has recently suffered a series of medical complications, but will get a new and promising surgery in January. How does she feel? I am ecstatic. <laughs> um, I went for the spinal tap back in November where they tested this to see if the medication going into my spinal fluid would work and it worked beautifully. I stood up straight, which is not something I've ever been able to do. Like other students, Kristen expects to get a good job after graduation, preferably with the government, but there's only one other thing that she truly deserves. At least back to what it was before the summer, if not better. I'm hoping better, but I will be satisfied if I can just walk again.